welcome back to my channel. I know I've been gone for like a year, year and a half, but I'm back and I'm engaged. Hold that thought, let me go grab my ring. Okay, got my ring. Today, I wanted to show you guys some wedding signs that I've been doing. I know I've been doing so much YouTube research on wedding signs, DIY decorations. I say if I can't DIY it, I don't wanna do it. Why would I spend a ton of money if I don't have to? If you have any ideas or topics that you wanna know, um, leave them in the description box down below. And if you like wedding stuff, if you're newly engaged, give this video a thumbs up. So excited for you. This is such an exciting journey and I would love for you to be on the journey with me and let's do this together and DIY stuff. If you love DIYing things or wedding stuff or vlogs, daily life, subscribe and see what we're all about. Um, yeah, so let's just get right into the video. Okay. So I went into Lowe's for some supplies, picked up this sheet of plywood for $10.25 a sheet, and you can have them cut it into three to get the size that I used. And then for the stain, I like a darker color, so I used a finish called the Dark Walnut. And then they also have the oil-based Sharpie markers, which I used one off of Amazon, which I'll link below. show you how I remove the flower from the stem if you pinch it right there and pull out the stem then your flower will stay a flower but if you don't then your whole flower will fall apart just FYI
the final look. I love the way that it turned out. I hope you were able to follow along. If you did, let me know in the comments below and I'll see you guys next time.